Wow! Let me tell y'all something, man. I'm actually going to take a shot on this because I'm about to get litty titty, okay? I don't know. I'm so wasted. If I said some shit like that. Mm, that's pretty good. After your tongue getting numb, you don't give a shit. So, I seen the article. I have not even read over the article. You know why I didn't read over the article? Because they said Master Chief is going to be unmasked. Y'all, let me tell y'all something now, okay? And this is going to sound like an old-ass man. Master Chief being unmasked is the most dumbest shit y'all can do. I'm going to tell you why that's dumb on so many levels. Now, one thing that we all love is the aura of being inside of another universe. That's why this metaverse idea is going to happen. Because the idea of actually having our body somewhere else and experiencing something that gives us this, um I can't think of the name of it, but it's like a, is it euphora or something that's just so beautiful that we want to stay there? I do believe we will see homeless people sitting down with VR headsets. That will happen one day, right? So if you unmask Master Chief, if you unmask him, what you are doing is you not only are changing the brand of Halo, you are taking a risk at hurting the franchise overall. And people might say I'm going overboard. Nick, oh, that's a hot take. I'm not going overboard. I'm going to tell you something. I remember a big thing people talking about. I'm not sure if it's Spider-Man. What superhero was it that they mentioned now has turned um, the, the superheroes gay? There was backlash about that. Um, superheroes being played as another race. There has been backlash against that. These things are actual things that people can relate to. But one thing I'm going to talk about that a lot of people don't relate to is putting yourself in another atmosphere. Being Master Chief is not only about being, you know, this, this guy in a suit. It embodies everything a Halo. It's literally Halo. Like every time, I don't care if you talk about Halo ODST. Every time I see a guy in a suit, I think of Master Chief. I don't know who he is. That's what makes Master Chief beautiful. If you don't make something where Master Chief's helmet is not stuck on forever, you'd have messed up. Now, I remember movies like Spawn, okay? I seen Spawn take off the mask. And oh my God, it's horrific. But Spawn is from hell. Master Chief doesn't say much. But when, if Master Chief takes off that mask, I am telling you guys, mark my words, I don't care how the dude looks. I don't care if it's a woman. I don't care what it is. It's going to hurt the franchise because the aura of the character is what we love. It's not who's under it. It's what they're doing while they're inside of the suit. Now, from what's being said about this Halo TV show, we will be seeing Master Chief unmasked. And I would like to ask you guys, would it matter? Let's say Master Chief took off the mask. My man looking like Matthew McConaughey in his prime. All right, I don't know how. You know, you say the names that always be, you know, he's looking like Luke Perry back on 90210. You know, I don't know the name. But, you know, my man's as handsome as can be. Let's say, let's say he comes out of there and it's a woman with long dreads, beautiful brown skin. Bow! We don't know. You know, but one thing I will say is that once you take off the mask, you are going to isolate some. Anybody can be under that suit. I can be under that suit. You can be under that suit. Anybody can be. It could be male, female. Shit, it could be a 13-year-old boy who's just like a damn man. Anybody. 
But the moment you take that off, you change the aura of the character. There are people right now who subconsciously love Master Chief because of the aura that when you take it away, I promise you, they will say, "Ah, Master Chief, I. That's just the way it is. Now, for me, I am a guy that loves the aura. And I'm going to tell you how bad I love the aura. Bioshock movie. Everybody's been talking about it. I am one of those people that love a Bioshock movie. I remember playing Bioshock and I felt like I was living in rapture. For real. Like I was in there. I was fighting people like, ah, give me another one. You know, that shit was real. That's how I want to feel. Now, again, I was playing late night. I was also probably sipping Patron and it was nobody around. But that's how you want to feel in the game. That's the best feeling. But you know what would have hurt the game? If they showed my character. That ruined it. All they had to do is show my character. They show me I look like some dude that's about 50 years old with bald spot back here and something else. Oh, I'm toe up. That's it. That ain't me. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I'm playing as some other dude. The aura of not you can always be that person. That's what makes it good. Why would the TV show want to unmask? Now, if you're telling me, if I'm Bungie, right, and you tell me, hey, you know, I I don't even care who. If you tell me you want to unmask Master Chief, I think you're hurting my franchise. That's almost like saying, hey, we want to put Mario in a whole nother way where his face doesn't look like Mario. You know what I'm saying? He's another dude. He's transforming to a normal person. That don't work. That don't work. I'm sorry. Now, let's go ahead and get to the article because I'm, you know. I'm smoking today. Shit. All right, here we go. Let's pull it up on screen. I got my buttons ready. Oh, oh damn. I ain't doing it. See, that's that's the article, y'all. Excuse me. There we go. All right, there we go. I told you. I'm wasting. All right. Halo TV show will unmask the Master Chief. The Master Chief has been long helmeted hero of humanity. Hero of humanity through multiple games. So you telling me. When Master Chief gets some mass, will we hear the name Hero of Humanity? Comics, books, and spinoffs, but after 20 years of hiding, his face has been confirmed at the upcoming Paramount Plus. They had to put the plug in. Okay, shout out to the plug. Paramount Plus, get your subscription ready. Okay, guys, if you don't know, this is a subscription world. That's what we're moving into. So get your, get your trials ready. Download the privacy app. Okay, create you a temporary card and you sign up for the trial. You test it. These big corporations are not going to get these subscription dollars on us. Y'all get the privacy app and make sure to sign up for the trial. Let it take that one dollar. You try it out. They want to try to do it. Bam, you cut that card off. Get their ass. Okay, that's how you do it. Now, in an interview with IGN, Halo TV show executive producer in 343 Studios, head of Transmedia, Kiki Wolfkill. Damn, that's a fire name. Confirm that fans will see his face. Uh. Wolf Gale, you're killing me. You're killing me, Wolf Gale. She also explained why the helmet was coming off. It comes down to the story they are telling in the streaming show. I think we set out to tell a character story and a personal story. And once we really got into what the story was, it became clear that you really need to see the person in the armor and under the helmet. Mm. I'm sorry. I, I can't even read no more, Wolfkill. You didn't you didn't lost me, Wolfkill. Wolfkill, what the hell you talking about, Wolfkill? People don't want to see. Do you think I watch who the hell watches Halo or anything to see Master Chief take off the mask? Now, the only thing I hold up, hold up. Let me get my sound straight because I'm, I'm about to go off. The only thing I watch to see the mask being taken off is Scooby Doo. Okay, and when I watch Scooby-Doo, I can just fast forward to the end. If I don't have time, I can just go, damn, baby, I'm about to let's go ahead and see who it is. I told you it was him because they show him at the beginning. They always show him, baby. Okay, so I'm talking to my little girl. Okay, now let's go ahead. I'm going to go to the chat because, I, you know, I get to the chat. Okay, so let's see. My, my, My man say, let's point that out. Mandalorian showed his face. I guess it's going that route. I think so. I think it's going that route. Now, me, myself, kill the show in the face. You know what I mean? I I do believe in keeping the aura. Like, for me, the whole thing of, and I would say, a lot of superheroes have been unmasked. Like, let's be honest. 
How many superheroes do we know have never been unmasked? It's not a lot. A lot of them have been unmasked. But the difference is, is when you talk about sci-fi, these worlds and universes are not the same. So the Halo universe does not exist. Everybody else shows their face. That's perfect. Everybody else. If I want to assume Master Chief is whatever because I met Master Chief, show me Master Chief's father, daughter, sister, mother-in-law, niece, cousin. Show me Master Chief anybody, okay? And I can make my assumptions. But when you take off the mask, at that point, I don't know. I don't know how I feel anymore. I honestly kind of feel like they lost it with this one. So that's just me. Um, my last words before I move on, because like I said, I got to move on. I got a lot to talk about. You know what I mean? And for some reason, I'm so wasted. I turned and looked at the next category, and I thought it said Chloe and Tristan. I was saying, I'm not talking about no damn Chloe Kardashian. I'm wasted. Okay. But last piece, I think Jerry Springer, what does he call it? The last word or whatever. My last piece to say on this is that Halo. Do me a favor. If you're going to unmask him, please do the unmasking very well. Do not do the unmasking where it's just some, you know, like Sopranos where they showed the ending and it cut off and you never got the whole thing or you show a half a face or a part of face or it's great. Just show the face. If you're going to show it, show it right. Do the whole scene straight. Let it go through and he take off the mask and then he talks and we get to find out who Master Chief is. But I'm telling you, when Master Chief, when we find out who Master Chief is, what if Master Chief is a dude who looks like Quagmire, our family guy? Like, 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 what would you do? You know what I'm saying? Would you love? <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I might actually love Master Chief more if it was Quagmire. You know what I'm saying? Just take off the mask and just make it Quagmire. You know what I mean? But 